Hey everyone, so I want to teach you guys this uh, nice setup for a takedown here uh, to submission attempt. Uh, I like, it's like a snap down, so front headlock, you know, to cradle. That's kind of like what we're going to show you guys right now. So uh, I like to call a tie. Okay, I like to pull his head down. Once I pull his head down, I like to lock up like a front headlock position here. I want to snap him down, sprawl. A lot of times they will post and they, they, they're trying to stand back up. And as they do that, I kind of cut at an angle. And then what I want to do is control his head still. And I'll let go and I'll wrap around. Sometimes I have to S grip. Okay, so sometimes I'll S grip it. Okay, if I'm able to, I definitely want to gable grip it. Okay, but I'll S grip sometimes. I'll try to keep my head on their back. Okay, and then from there, I'm going to step over, hook their leg. And once I hook their leg, I'm going to pull it in. And then I'm gonna drive into them to force them on their side. Okay. I like to keep the cradle control. Look to pass. Once I pass, I can start looking for submission attempt ideas. In this case, I can go Dars. I can let go right here. Shoot this under. Go full Dars. Okay. I can look to step over. Looking for Kimura. I can also look to flatten them out. Once I flatten them out, I can look to go for our pillow choke. Okay. Screw the time. Sometimes I also do this from a sprawl scenario. So if he shoots on me, right? I'll sprawl, get my front headlock, he tries to stand back up. I'll cut the angle real quick, connect my hands, step over, drive in, pass, 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 with the cradle. So I keep the cradle like that. And then from here, kick my leg out and around. And then from there, I look to set up a submission attempt, okay? So Dars, Kimura, Okay, sometimes I just go one on guillotine. I can mount him with that. Okay, I can also let go, go under his neck, have his arms still trapped, go for my pillow choke series. Try it out.